Thanks for coming on over here. I know it's a it's a it's a trek not only to get to this part of town but also to climb up this friggin' driveway. No, it's totally fine. That's so nice of you. Yeah. So um, when I found out that you were gonna do that, I was super excited. You're promoting your new special, Hot for My Name, mm -hmm. out on Comedy Central now. And uh, Esther Provitsky, I guess. So welcome to the show. Thank you. How you feeling? What have you been up to today? Um, today I. Um, <sighs> I woke up and I my ankles hurt when I wake up, so it's like hard to step on the ground when I first wake up. And then I uh, I took my allergy pill because mm -hmm. it's sneezing. Yeah, so I I I've been sneezing a little bit sometimes. Since when? Today I got out of the shower. I had like five sneezes in a row. Really? No. No. Yes. Is it yes or no? No. I'd like to know the real answer. Truth is, I did. Yes. Okay, thank you. Um, and then I made my coffee. I wash and wash out some tie dyes. Um, I have. No, you have a tie dye business. Yeah, I do. Sleepover by Esther. Sleepover Esther. You could get that at uh, Esther Bravitsky is uh, is here dot com. And now, when you say wash out some shirts, what what does that mean? You're so interesting. <laughs> So what does that mean? Like you, you you put them in the water at night and then you take them out in the morning or put them in the dye at night and then when I in the morning I throw them in the washing machine. Interesting. <laughs> now so you have to leave it in the dye for for what? Eight hours or how long do you sleep? You're so busy, you do so much. You have you have a, a you have a lipstick line, uh, a yet. chapstick line, your uh, cybersecurity business. Not yet. Well, how do you how do you manage to get so much done in the day? You're so interesting. I'll tell you, I got a five subject notebook on Amazon. Wow. Yeah, and I take my notes in there. Wow. Now, Esther, it's not common for people's ankles to hurt when they get out of bed. Is it because of the weight of your body? I think it's because of how firm my bed is, so that my ankles kind of hang specifically on one. I sleep on my stomach, and then my ankles kind of hang inward. Interesting. <laughs> yes, I, I do. Now, have you tried sleeping on your back? I have tried that. And how does that work out? Now, this 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 special is interesting. You're so interesting. So you did this special, and uh, I watched it. It's super funny. You had your parents do half of it, right? Now, why is that? Because of what you do. Yeah. How do you feel? I'm so glad you came here. I feel hungry. Oh. Can we bring in some, some deli meats and some heavy creams for Esther, please? Do you want a Coke? Do you have Coke? I could check. Oh, is your uncle coming to bring me creams? If you want to find out if Simon's coming to bring Esther creams, make sure to tune in next week to Rick and Esther Have a Time. My name's Rick Glassman, and Esther... Hello. See, now you're in a fun mood. That's good. Now we got you. I think I know how we have to start the podcast. I have to pretend you're interesting. <laughs> and it's going to make you feel like, oh, I'm so not interesting that I get it. The only type of irony you get is people being interested in you. There's no way he really thinks I'm pretty. I get the game. You know what I want to do? I want to do a podcast called In the Edit, where you get to be there. Thank you. Yeah. I do think I really do appreciate that. So. Is it over? Not yet. Okay. Um, I'm going to talk for a little bit. You could get going. Is there Coke? You want me to check? Is there really wood here? You want to try that again? Is there really wood here? Yeah. A Diet Coke. <laughs> what? Well, why would you want that? Why does your hair look like that? It's not bad. It's just you look like a character today.
Great. Uh, RickGlassman.com. RickGlassman.nothing? Yeah. Um, Can you please check for a diet coke? That's fine. I didn't expect them to. You, for some reason, thought they would. I didn't know if they would. I just know that, like, um, Do you have Coke? I don't drink that. Oh. So. I, I don't. No. Will you treat me now? Will you do it like I'm coming on your podcast? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Hi. Thanks for coming. You're welcome. Thank you for coming. Yeah. Good. This is uh. This is a beautiful home. Thanks. It is um. It's just a set. I don't live here. Thank you. Um, so how are you? How, how are you feeling? How's your pandemic? It's, you know, the, the truth is uh, it'll take a while to explain, but I think the easy answer is I'm okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And you have a new show coming to Amazon mm-hmm. that you're the star of. Mm-hmm. Well, one of the stars. It's an ensemble show, it, and that's just the cast. I mean, there's the directors, there's the writers, there's the, this, the, the other people that work on a show. You didn't happen to bring any salami with you, did you? Uh, well, I have to see how comfortable. I, I, I've been told that you don't like penis humor, but my instinct was to say I have a huge hog in my pants. That's <laughs> not what I meant. But that's fu- the, you're funny. You're funny. Thank you. Um, Thank you. You right, You're really good at this. Yeah, so let's get started. Yeah, we're here. Started. We started. Um, what's your favorite? Do you have a favorite taste of the week? Is that you mean like a food? Mm-hmm. So I've been adding salt to everything. My sweets, my savories. I love not just any salt. It's called a topping salt. It's flake salt, and I love to add it on on and everything I'm eating. Tell me more. What brand? I forgot the name of the brand. Maldives or whatever? Maybe. It's a white box. Okay. And, yeah, you know, I, 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 uh, I intentionally, when I cook, I don't season it with too much salt because I know I'm going to want to put it on top at the end uh, when I get my, my vegan mint chip ice cream from Salt and Straw. I either sometimes put it on top or sometimes I have a little spoon with salt, a separate one, and then as I'm going... I salt the, the top a little bit, and I eat, and after I finish that layer, I put another little bit of salt on. My pastas, I'm adding salt on. My almond butter sandwiches, I'm adding salt on. Rick, I am attracted to you right now. You know what I made uh, two nights ago? I took a whole peach, a little bit of lemonade, ice cubes, strawberry jam, honey, salt, blended it up, had a <laughs> delicious, and it wasn't even a smoothie. I meant to make a smoothie. I put too much lemonade in, but it just became a peach lemonade with like a hint of strawberry. It was very, it was, it could have been drinking with a straw. It was delicious. I was also surprised at how much peach I got out of the peach. Okay, wait, 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 wait. How do you acquire the salt and straw mint chip? Post-its. If they have that flavor right now, you think? They've been, uh, for months, I, I, I get two at a time. I do it once every, like, ten days. Oh. It's delicious. Go. You could go. Like right now, I have to That's fine. We could end. Do you want to go get your ice cream? Should we? Should we end it? 
All right, well, that's, that, what, what's the name of your podcast? Okay, thanks for tuning into the Esther's Club. Well, I gotta say, but when I came here, I was I was told that you're a misery, but I've had a really good time. You let me do a salami joke. You said you were attracted to me because I eat salt. And then once things were going well, you wanted to end it. I think your instincts are great. I think you're hilarious. I think you're more beautiful in person, which... Oh, that camera's done. But we have other cameras going. Anyway, thank you for tuning into... Why are there two cameras on you? That's oh my God. My, that's my camera. Okay. That's your camera. Okay. That camera is on both of us. It's a, it's a wide. Okay, but it's obviously if that was a better angle for you. No. And what's that camera? That I'm testing because it was too close here. So I have a fourth camera because it's not wide enough to go there. So I thought I could see what it looks like. Okay. What that shot looks like so you can see how it's both of us. Okay, I thought you were going to throw your phone at me. Oh, no, no. I would never throw my phone at you, Esther. You're too funny. We had a great clean ending, and we could end it there, but it might be nice to just keep this. Sure. Well, I'll do whatever. Yeah. Did you get it? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. So are you happy with the cameras? I'm, I wouldn't say happy, but I'm okay with them. What would make you happier? Uh... We can discuss that off air. It's just you and me here. No, I don't. You love honesty. Just looking you're hiding. I don't know. I guess just like that camera seems really far away from me. Check this out. I love to. La da da di da 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 da. La da da di da 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 da. Now this picture I'm showing you is from my first test. Uh, I moved a couple of things, but as far as the framing is concerned, and I could still push in more if I want. Okay. How does that look? That looks like a good... That looks good. Right. I know. But I was like, so you'll, you can pull from your medium? If that's what I, I feel is best. But Ooh, I, you don't like this. I don't want to have to do a very tight shot on you for no reason. Are you trying to hide something? Uh, I'm... Maybe. If that's the case, we could talk about that. Okay. If you have, like... Like, if you if you want to be framed a certain way for, like, vanity reasons, uh -huh. I'm happy to do that. It actually might be cool to put a chair behind the couch. What and, do you mean? And just have your head popping up. Yeah, I, I... Just the eyes. I think you look really cute. It's weird that you say that. Really, I think that you look better than you've ever looked. Why? You just... I don't know. You look... You look good. Your clothes fit you well. I, 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 I think you have a very nice body, and you should be really proud of yourself. Why? Because the world has decided that all women are beautiful. Mm. Thank God, finally. And you fit into that. All women? Yeah. <laughs> I think it's also important that you own it, because there's a lot of little girls and boys at home that look just like you that you could be like, oh, look, she's owning it. Mm -hmm. I agree. You have cool earrings. Thank you. You know, I have a little thing things. with this and like, you know, you have like a vibe. You have businesses. Yeah. You're engaged. You have a beautiful home. An adorable dog. I love my dog. You have nothing to hide. You should be proud of yourself. Thank you. You're my prettiest friend. Thank you for watching this on Patreon. <laughs> if you want to see more, um, for it to be worth it for either of us, we're going to be charging $30 a month. Would you feel comfortable doing a podcast if it had 100 subscribers at $30 a month? How much would I make? Around 1000 bucks. Why do you ask?
Because I have 100 people that message me that said if you did a podcast with Esther on Patreon, I would pay 30 bucks a month.